Hello and welcome to the second preview episode we're doing. It's Talkie v Wrexham this Saturday. I'm joined by Dom. Yes, sir. And well, big game. Wrexham have sold out their allocation, haven't they? I'm really looking forward to the atmosphere. Obviously, they've spent a lot of money. Um, so they should win comfortably, obviously, on paper and all that. And there's no <laughs> pressure on Torquay at all to do anything. But no, I'm, I'm really looking forward to it. Um, it is what it is with Wrexham's money. It's, it's everyone's dream, isn't it, to have owners like that? So um i'm i am actually a bit happy it goes to a team that's got a background as well but whatever you know if, if they want to spend three hundred thousand five hundred thousand and not beat maidenhead then it is not we're not problem. jealous at all no, we're not jealous saying. at all is what we're saying yeah, make that and clear <laughs> make it clear we're not jealous of Wrexham yeah. assault and no yeah. one in this league yeah. is yeah. but okay. going to the game you've done a bit of research haven't you on Wrexham and all that <laughs> Um, a little bit, yeah, yeah. I mean, obviously, there's a bit, fair bit of pressure on them. I mean, what yeah. they spent eight hundred grand this month yeah, on signings. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I think if you probably added up Torquay's hundred and twenty year history, <laughs> we haven't spent that on, on players have we, in that time. No, um, no. I, I can't, I can't confirm that. I'll maybe ask Steve Harris to. Uh, toss <laughs> yeah. up a thing. Uh, they're in pretty good form. I mean, looking back at what they've done recently, they've won three out of the last five. Yeah. 10 points in that time, but they did yeah. um, draw on Saturday. 10 man, Maidenhead. Old, 10 man Mullin sent off, yeah. Yeah, oh, you spoiled it for me there. I was just <laughs> going to explain that. Myself. Um, yeah, well, one all in the end, which they'll be really disappointed about. So mm. they, they're just trying to build it up ahead of steam to yeah, get for, into the top few places, to be honest. Yeah, it? yeah. It's get... where they expect to be. Yeah, I mean, if the, if the title battle they reach probably is at the moment, if you look at Stockport, how they're catching Chesterfield. Um, and you've got yeah, like I mean, Bondi. Stockport are looking for their 10th win in a row on Saturday. Yeah, exactly. and I think that they're playing Dover, so I, I think they yeah. might just do it. Yeah, no, I, I think, um, yeah, I think for me personally, I think playoffs is probably Wrexham's biggest option. And you would think that if they get the home ties in like third or whatever, then they they prefer, it'd be more pressure though. So I think I'm out of pressure, but when, when I see that um, fee come through, I know it's undisclosed for that um, one I got from Burton. Yeah, but, there's speculation. Isn't but obviously, but I just feel like it puts pressure on them, if that makes sense. But he's probably a great player, but you know, how would it work, you know, a player who's gone from League One, you know, fighting for his place in League One, so all of a sudden, I guess go to divisions down, you know, it's a brilliant project for a player. I'm not, you know, and it's probably a life-changing wage for him and his family, of course. I'm not discouraging it at all. Um, and, mm. and I'm not saying it's going to come down and just have no attitude. But uh, it's quite, it's it's a different one. And National League's very sort of difficult league. Um, it is a difficult league. I mean, you look at the teams like Borum and Dagenham, and all, yeah. those, all those types of teams scrapping yeah. near the top, plus the, the, mm. the teams that have spent good money. Um, yeah. Plus, Wrexham have just got to fit these players in. There's no magic yeah. formula to exactly, get no. them in the team and make it work. Um, no. So they've got to try and do that. I mean, they should be in the playoffs. Or in, you know, yeah. it's just trying to get well in the top few positions. So they don't have mm. to. Yeah, and go I, through I, the hardest route, I guess. So. It'd, it'd be an interesting game because obviously these players, um, you know, they've gone from League One. You're getting teams like Sunderland, your Portsmouth, and stadiums like that, and then you're getting kicked lumps out of you by some part-time teams in the National League. You know, it'd be interesting how they do. Mm, but you, you know, say that, you say that, but the teams generally do play football in the National do. League yeah. these days. They do, they yeah. do. But it'd, be, it'd be interesting. But going back to the team we support, you know, that Torquay team. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> obviously, we're, mi- we're missing Danny Wright. It's a big miss. We found out at Solio we need a striker yeah. desperately. Um, if no one comes yeah. in, uh, low loss up front, or is it going to be false nine? Or is it going to be Holman? I don't know. I, I, I see that Wrexham play a 3 5 2 normally. So I, I right. wouldn't be surprised if he matches up to that. Yeah, I would like maybe to see. Put, maybe put, he can maybe put Lolas together with yeah. Dolman up front. Dolman and Dolman behind. Yeah, Rex won't be able to I'm not sure him. he wants to. I'm not sure he wants to put Lolas up front. Mm, I think he wants to play because yeah. I think he likes to play behind the striker, doesn't he? And find some yeah. room. I just don't think he'll offer much. Um, no, against they got the toes Danny, there, haven't the they? Right yeah. Yeah. yeah, but like, yeah, it'd be an interesting game. I mean. The pressure isn't on Torquay, but I mean, as we said in our Power Rankings episode, you know, there'll be a lot of Torquay players just angling, so, you know, making an impression against Wrexham, obviously, and just against the Yeah, it's going to be a lively atmosphere. There's going to be a big yeah, crowd. It's going to be a proper it's just, football it's league what, crowd that we It's just missed. what we want yeah. to support, isn't it? Yeah. I, I, I mean, I, last time we had that, I think, was a Stockport game, maybe. Yeah, I mean, Yeovil yeah. brought a lot down, but they didn't make much noise, no, did they? they? Um, Stockport 
Stockport felt like a proper football league yeah. fixture, wouldn't we? That's what uh, I want. I mean, no disrespect, want, yeah. no. To, no disrespect to the daggers and solid mm. holes of this world, yeah. but they bring down 30, 40 people. Yeah, of course. It's just, yeah. Doesn't make for much of a. No, you like it bouncing off, and then it sort of makes the, the game more interesting. It gives you that extra edge. And I mean, yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's one of those weird things. If we're going to lose, I want to lose to like a big away following because <laughs> at least it's something to see when you're really miserable and then it just erupts you know and they're brilliant but it'd be, it'd be nice to have that because if i'm honest i wasn't at the stop game i couldn't get to it so you know i personally missed it a lot um, i think we'll probably need a similar type of performance because yeah. they'll try and bust, they'll try and bust the game definitely yeah. and get it to their uh, you know long big throws money as well but... their long throw as well so we need to be yeah it did us in the first fixture they did it, yeah. i remember but yeah, but yeah, we stood up then, so similar yeah. kind of performance, stand up to it, and um, yeah, having Lewis back or should be a big yeah him and bonus. Yeah. And of course, yeah. they haven't got Paul Mo front of these. No, they've only got. Not, uh, they, not that he's scored as many goals as I'd expect this season, but he's no. still a danger man, isn't he? So. No, I mean, yeah, exactly. And obviously, they've got um, was it Ollie Palmer who scored from Wimbledon? Ollie There's Palmer from Wimbledon. Man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, he, he hasn't scored a hatful in the in the league, but no. they must. They must think he'll he'll do. Yeah, the I mean the pressure's on him, isn't it? There's so much pressure on him. You know, if he misses his first chance, yeah. every, every other way, every team they play will be on on their backs. It's simple as. So, but yeah, yeah. But footballers are paying and to the do. pressure on the big teams does give the little sort of the little yeah. ones a bit of hope, doesn't it? Like Boreham yeah. and um, yeah, exactly. The other ones that are Bromley, up there, the yeah. Bromleys and those kind of teams, because they mm. they can just play with a no pressure kind of like yeah, we can do it. Yeah. To all kind of things. So, but yeah, no, it's going to be, gonna be, be a great game. I mean, for neutral, the, the National League is a very um, interesting season, isn't it? It's we're ridiculous. Just, we're just hoping we can get in amongst it, but. But yeah, yeah, I just I just want us to hold our own against these teams. You know, no, you don't want to be battered three, four nil by your Rexons and that like we were at the start of the season, not Rexon themselves. But you know, when we're outclassed with teams and so far, so you, from our point of view, just give them a good game. Get, I mean, we need to win. We need to get a draw on that. I was it was quite a disappointing result last Tuesday. Yeah, I mean the solid hole lost. Form. Yeah. We're 11 points behind them in the playoffs now, and 11 points is a big gap, isn't it? Plus, when your strikers have been nine. injured, so. 19 to play, probably need to win at least 10 of those. It's yeah, it's getting it's getting very difficult now. Yeah, and, um, of course. Yeah. No, we, you know, like I just we'll see. On it. there's not that immediate pressure on talk after this for a few weeks now. It, you know, it's not like I'm saying we want our seems to be a dead rubber, but obviously, if you look where Halifax are, we were in a similar position last year where you're like if you slip up and your title might be gone, kind of thing every week. Well, we just seem to get that form together, yeah. which we were, but that solid old game really was just. Just quite a stop for us, wasn't it? Um, it was a kick in the teeth, and I yeah, think people have been that a bit subdued. A, that was a terminology. I was subdued since then. <laughs> yeah, a bit uh, of the, generally the supports have been quite yeah. subdued since then. We haven't as, had very much social media no. buzz. Definitely but it should build up. <laughs> this, this is the sort of game that should build up nicely. And yeah, win there'll a be game plenty and of be back, so. anticipation. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, win on Saturday, we'll be feeling better, won't we? Yeah, HMS. Playoffs are all back in. Yeah. <laughs> and then the buzzing will be one game at a t- I keep sending people one game at a time, Sam, all season, yeah. but nobody listens. To no. <laughs> <laughs> but just I, I hope everyone just goes and enjoys it. It'll be, it'll be a spectacle, whatever happens. So yeah, yeah make think, some noise, enjoy the atmosphere. Yeah, get behind the yeah, team. Yeah, Even if we go one or down, just please get behind the team. You know, we don't want to be one of those yeah. dull supports the skeps on the team's back so we know it's going to be difficult yeah for pop, I thought the pop side was great last Tuesday they just kept on singing yeah. I can't remember what they were singing but it yeah. went on for about yeah and no, they're brilliant minutes. they were brilliant, it was brilliant. so yeah. and they re- and they start to pick the game up so just keep doing that um yeah definitely and yeah and hopefully it'll be a good game for everyone so yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this um please like subscribe have you got and- a prediction Sam oh yeah two two as I said, kids, as we're doing this, it's the 2nd of February 2022, so 2-2. Yeah. <laughs> I'll say one all, I think. Yeah, sit on the, go, sit sitting on the, on the fence, sit aren't we? What a, fence. Way to finish, what a way to finish the video. <laughs> sitting on the fence, 2-2. Yeah, let's, let's do yeah, that. Yeah, we'll see. Yeah. Cool. Thanks for watching.